This is the Intelligent Human Voice Podcast Broadcast Network. This is your host, the Pad Man, from the Bay to LA and beyond. It's Monday, and you know what? I'm going unscripted on this one. Unscripted Mondays, that's right. You know what I'm going to talk about? I'm going to talk about what you're talking about. I'm talking about the people that are following me and me that are following people and everywhere on social media. Someone's talking about something. So uh, look at that. Russell Brand just popped up. How does that happen? How does it happen? So now if you're on Facebook and you're following someone and they, they do a live feed, a window just pops up out of nowhere and, uh, well, it disappeared. It used to didn't disappear. Because I'd I be doing work or I'm doing my scrolling, looking at someone's Facebook profile. And somebody's video just pops up out of nowhere. I'm like, get out of here. Get out of here. But Russell Brand always has something super positive. Really smart dude. Always has something awesome to say. Or at least something awesome I like to hear. So I don't mind Russell Brand um, popping up on my Facebook scrolling. Anyway, I'm going to give some shout outs to some of my friends out there, some of my really close friends and some people I haven't heard from in a long time. Like Rena, what's up Rena? I got the message from you, homie. Yeah, I know you've been traveling, doing your thing. That's what's up. That's what's up. But uh, return a brother message. All right. All right. No, don't play. You got the number too, so you can call a brother. I want to give a shout out to my homegirl, Tiger Moon. Tiger, you, you, you said somebody was trying to buy some cookies. I, my phone didn't, um, it didn't ring. I didn't see no messages, no calls. Hey, if you guys want some cookies, you know where to go. DudeCanBake.com. That's right. Fill out the form. Send a message. It comes directly to me, and uh, we'll see what you want. Uh, we have a two minimum, uh, two dozen minimum. Now, you yeah, We'll work out a deal. It's Valentine's Day for crying out loud. Get your girl some cookies. Get your guy some cookies. What, what do you want? I, I got peanut butter chocolate. I got coconut cranberry. And they're all square cookies and square bars. That's what's up. Tiger, hit me up and uh, let me know who's trying to get some cookies. Um, I'll hook them up a deal. I want to say what's up to my homie, my homie from the Bay, D. Brown, Demetrius Poet Brown. Dude, I'm on your site. Okay, here we go. So, me and my boy D, we've been talking about this podcast idea show that we've had for, I've been here 13 years, um, and, you know, he, he hit me up, we check in from time to time, he's like, yo, yo, what's up with the, I'm like, yeah, yo, what's up, get up, yo, so <laughs> it was like that, but I want to uh, draw some attention to, um, he's also the owner of I Am Empowerment Clothing. And if you go to, I believe it's the I am, I'm on your site now, dog. Let me see. I believe it's I am. Look up I am empowerment clothing. Demetrius Brown is one of my friends and he sells some awesome shirts. Here it is. I'm sorry. Here it is. www.iweariam.com. Some really positive uh, t-shirts and logos and good literature you don't want to walk around saying the wrong thing to people have the t-shirt say it for you by going to well i'm not going to repeat the website again you should have gotten it anyway this is scrolling i'm scrolling on social media today you know looking up people that i know probably drop oh i want that's that's what got this started so i follow will smith and will smith man how can you hate on will smith that's all i gotta say he he, he seemed like he was a little ticked off and I'd be ticked off too because I guess some folks made some comments about him not knowing the La Bamba song and and he uh, he filmed himself <laughs> driving <laughs> driving singing the La Bamba song not missing a note in Spanish so come on come on they, they, they don't 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 talk about Will Smith. Don't talk about Jada Pinkett. Don't talk about none of his family. The man has done work. He has done work. And like the Philly brother he is, um, I love his posts because he's always got something super positive and inspiring to say. And that's what it's about. That's what we need in this world. We need more celebrities, more 
people like myself, more you out there with your voice saying the things that need to be said. Otherwise, you know, you're going to get power to all the negative nonsense that other people spewing. You know, we're talking about positivity here. Let me try to keep it positive anyway. Let me tell you more about the human voice itself, the power of the human voice. Um, did you know that just listening to someone talk about their story, it, it can fill you with empathy and compassion, but also you have to, you have to have the power to, you know, not just be a listener, but be able to, you know, help those people um, and, and let them know that, look, you know what? Everybody goes through something. Here's a little positive advice. Rock with it. Roll with it. But that story is not you. The story that is you is what's happening right now, right this instant, in the world, right now. The past, the stories are just stories. We all have stories. I got more stories than you. I swear, I know I got more stories than you. And some of my friends know this because I've shared some of my stories with them. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Oh, I want to give some love to Jessica, Jessica Allstrom. She is the CEO of Transcendent Wellness. And Jessica inspired me to come out of the closet with, you know, keeping my creative juice away from you and the people that need to hear more positive talk and music and all that stuff. Um, thank you, Jessica, for, you know, putting the pumps on that because I, I really was just holding back and I would make an excuse. Oh, I got a cold. Like I have a little cold today, but I can still record. I mean, a voice is a voice. So uh, Jessica does these uh, Sunday, second Sunday power sessions where she talks and she's always, she seems to always be on point with a great message. And I tuned in uh, yesterday. It was, it was super powerful. So I want to give a shout out to Jessica for that. And thank you for inspiring us. Yes, you are doing it. You're rocking and rolling. I want to give a shout out to my homegirl sister, Amira Beth. She's in Hawaii. She's always posting positivity in the world. Love you. Love her. Love what you do. Keep doing it, rocking and rolling. Uh, who else? Oh, my homegirl, Stasha. Stasha. Me and Stasha connected last week, and we had a great powwow session on moving forward and things that we're going to help each other move forward on. I'm looking at your site now, Stasha, and it says... Wait, there's a book? You wrote a book? Enter the red circle and your business and your business, your flow. Okay, Stasha wrote a book, everybody. And uh you gotta let me let me just tell you what Stasha's thing is. And for some of you guys who might be listening, you could learn a few things. Uh she studied uh holistic health coaching at the Institute of Integrative Nutrition, studied also at uh, Point Park University. She's now living here in Los Angeles. She's from New York. She's got the New York accent every now and then. But she is the founder of The Period Coach. Yeah, The Period Coach. We're going to have her on the show one day to talk more about that because she is uh, getting a nice little following Um on Instagram and whatnot. So whatnot. I love that word whatnot. If you haven't seen uh Disjoint It, the uh it's a series on Netflix and it's all about the marijuana business. It is hilarious. I don't like giving pubs to stuff that I don't need pubs, but I, I, I said whatnot and if you saw the show you you get it because I say whatnot a lot and Anyway, look up Stasha. She is the, uh, what she has a, I don't know if she has a website. I, I'm not sure if she has a website. But she's, she's helping women everywhere deal with that time of the month. Yes. You know, everybody needs help somewhere. That's right. That's what we're here for. That's what we're here for. I want to give a shout out to my homegirl, Stephanie. 
for posting um, that a brother is looking for work. I have my radio show because I own my own equipment. I built a 214, 16-track digital studio over the past um, 13 years when I moved here to L.A., Run into a lot of yahoos who are just talking, talk, talk, talking, talk about studio time and this, that, and the other. And I was like, you know, I'm not dealing with this nonsense. I'm just going to buy my own equipment and start producing my music again by myself. And that's what I'm doing here. That's what you heard earlier. A couple more songs I'm going to drop on you. We're almost out of time. You know, time goes by so fast when you're having fun. Anyway, Stephanie, thanks for pumping me on your Facebook site, letting people know that this intelligent brother is looking for work in leadership. Facility management is my thing. Facility management. I have a facility management consulting company that I've started, you know, after I resigned from my job uh, two years ago. So, if you got a home, if you got a business, if you need somebody to come in and assess the situation at hand, give me a call. It's going to cost you, but it could cost you in the long run unless you talk to me first. All right, just putting it out there, just putting it out there. Who else I want to give some, draw some attention to? Uh, here's some more friends. Valentine's Day is coming up. And um, it's not my favorite day, I can tell you that much. But I'm into the love, I'm into positivity, so I'm just going to edit that. Well, I can't edit it because it's live, but let's bring more love to the planet, people. Let's bring just a little more love. That's all we know what the world needs now. Love, sweet love, give us some love. I like being silly. I think I'm going to do more unscripted um, podcasts. And maybe I'll get more people to listen and subscribe. You can subscribe to my podcast, The Intelligent Human Voice Podcast Broadcast Network. That's right. What's up, Naomi? I see you. I see you. I haven't seen Naomi in a while. Who else? I want to mess with some people. I got a few more. I got about two minutes. Oh, Got to bring attention to my homegirl, Chef Afia. I met Chef Afia at, where to meet her? I met her. I was um, was vending my cookies at Angel City Brewery. That's right, in the Angel City Brewery. If you've never gone to Angel City and got some brew, you're missing out. Anyway, I was there doing the cookies, and she came over, and we chopped it up. We've been pals ever since. She is awesome. She does these awesome dinners um, I'm looking at her site now and looks like potato wrap prawns or something, something. Woo. You, you, you gotta, we gotta talk cause you're supposed to have you on the site. She, she's an awesome chef and she cooks up some really, uh, health conscious meals out there. So I want to give a shout out to my home girl, Afia, chef Afia. What's up, Mo, Maurice. Give a shout out to my boy Pierre too. I hear he's not doing too well, man. Give a shout out and some love to my boy Pierre. Yo, people, we got to we got to take care of ourselves. Don't rely on the doctors. The doctors. I, there's a book out there called and I can't find it. It's like it's disappeared. It's called Black Man in a White Coat, and it's about a brother who went to medical school and he's talking about all the nonsense that went on behind the scenes. So. Uh, I, I can only read excerpts here and there, but um, he talks about it. He talks about, look, your health, man, it's, it's, it's about you. You take care of you. You know what I mean? You take care of you. Don't wait for the doctor. You know, by the time you get to the doctor, it's too late. No, he's like, yo, I don't know what you've been doing, but whatever you've been doing, you need to stop it. Not my doc. He was like, whatever you're doing, just keep on doing it. I'm like, yeah, yeah, right. Like, I'm listening to you. Anyway, this is the Intelligent Human Voice Podcast Broadcast Network. I'm your host, the Pat Man, and I'm out of here just freestyling on a Monday, unscripted. I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do it one more again. How about that? My show, do what I want to do. Peace. Peace.